Durkheim. Exciting. found my church how did i only find out about this place now my life didn't have a purpose you me sunday the dark room all this time wasted listening to david Guetta. i must say german man huge dicks it's impossible to explain how it is you have to have been there you want to go to burka and dress like this <sighs> nope hey boss i'm not coming in for work on monday okay I'm so glad they have such a strict door policy. With that, you only meet people with the same open mind inside. Which Monday? All of them. You went on a Friday only? <laughs> so you've never actually been? Never thought that the smell of sweat and feces could trigger good memories. <sighs> what? You took a photo at Burkhain? Delete it. Delete it. Now. If you say one more time that techno is EDM, you will die. I will never be rejected because I have the Burkhain look. People know me at the door. Don't expect me to answer my phone on Sunday or Monday. I'll call you back on Tuesday, all right? Burkhain isn't just a club, it's a temple. Me and my friends are going there to pray every Sunday. I can see by the way people move if it's their first time. Mm -hmm. Who we're praying to? The techno god. Going to Berghain, I saved so much money on food, water and electricity. Last weekend I spent there like 30 hours. The week before it was 25 and the week before that was crazy, it was almost 40. Berghain is kind of my second home. It's basically my living room. I could even rent my flat on Airbnb for the weekend. I don't need it. Sometimes it gets really boring because I see the same faces every week. Only tourists call it Berghain. We call it Bergi or Hain, but not Berghain. If you do, you're outing yourself as a tourist. This place changes you forever.